Plamov, Long Distance RNA Signaling in Plants. Plants are amazing. From a tiny seed, some grow into the largest organisms on Earth. They are brilliant in providing oxygen, take up CO2, and they give us most of our food. But plants are stuck in one place, exposed to the elements. So they have to adapt all the time and make sure that the leaves know what is going on in the roots and vice versa. But how do they coordinate all of this and react as needed? For this, there are thousands of different signaling molecules traveling through the plant's vascular system, comparable to our bloodstream. This happens from the roots up and the other way around. Recently, an exciting discovery was made. Some of the signals are RNAs. While the DNA is the genetic information in the cell's nucleus, the RNAs are short copies of DNA, providing instructions on how to make proteins. Now, most RNAs stay in the cell where they are produced. But why are some signaling molecules? More specifically, Plamov scientists want to know, why are some RNAs transported? How are they selected for this transport? What determines where they go? What do they do at their destination? So the scientists look at the cells where the RNAs are made. They examine the transport itself, study where the RNA ends up, and find out what their function is. They analyze what binds to the RNA and use computer models for this work. So why is the RNA transport important? For example, these moving RNAs influence when plants flower, how they use nutrients, and also the shape of their leaves, all of which affects how strong and healthy plants are and how much food they can produce. So better understanding this RNA transport could help farming adjust to climate change. Scientists from three of Europe's leading plant research organizations come together in this project. Visit our website, www.plamoff.eu, to find out more and follow us on Twitter and LinkedIn. This project has received funding from the European Research Council under the European Union's Horizon 2020 Research and Innovation Program.